Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the rest of June, okay? So, what do we have for Leo? Bread. Period of prosperity and abundance. The rest of June. So there, you may, if you're lacking, you might not be for much longer. Period of prosperity and abundance. Having plenty. Door. Opportunities are waiting for you. So there is an opportunity that is waiting for you. This looks good. This looks really good so far. So you have a period of prosperity and abundance. You have a new opportunity. It's behind that door. Okay, so you it's waiting. You, you haven't gotten it yet. You have you maybe you haven't seen it yet. The month of September. So September is prominent. You could also be dealing with a Virgo or a Libra. The month of September is prominent. Maybe that's when that opportunity uh, is taken or comes to fruition or whatever. But the, somehow the month of September is prominent here. Period of prosperity and abundance. Going through a new door. I think that you, you know, I, I don't know. I think September comes, oh, obviously September comes later. Something about the month, maybe something that you did in the month of September is going to pay off because this is like abundance. This is reward. Maybe something that you're, this is what I just heard, something that you're doing now is going to be very fruitful in September. Not that you're not going to be abundant now, but I feel like it's in September. September's harvest time. And this is harvest time as well to me. So something that you are doing now may open up a new door for you in September. <laughs> okay, whatever. Okay, what do we have for Leo? Oh, I just looked on the bottom. You want to see it? Wish granted. We'll find out. Wish granted. We'll see. What do we have? Okay. Look deeper. Something is hidden. Something is hidden. Something about that door. Hmm. Act now. Think later. Those are strong messages. They are. later bad timing bad timing hmm. 911 911 is emergency I created this deck and when I created this card I was thinking of 911 emergency bad timing there's something happening urgently it's urgent look deeper right now right now it's urgent maybe you missed something because of the bad timing I don't think this emergency is like a medical emergency. I feel like there's something that you need to, I mean, it could be, I suppose. I, but I feel like it's something that you need to look at right now, immediately. Immediately. This is urgent. Oh, I just looked on the bottom again. I shouldn't have. Well, I'm going to show it to you. Doesn't want commitment. There could be somebody that doesn't want commitment. No, you figure that out. 9-1-1, which is September. Um, hmm. Something could happen in September, obviously. Something that you're doing now. Look deeper. Something is hidden. Act now. Think later. There's been some timing that was off. 
but ones are instant manifestation. So you're manifesting something and you have new beginnings. Nines are closure. So, so there's some sort of closure here and new beginnings. So that's good. But there's something that needs to be done immediately. It's urgent. This is an emergency. Whatever the hell it is. What do we got for Leo? Page of Wands. Look at that. Look at that. This guy, is, he's very excited. This is exciting, whatever it is. I mean, exciting new direction. Something to holler about. Something to scream about. Um, this is a lot of fun. Something is happening that is fun. This is exciting. Uh, taking big risks. Doing something spontaneous. Now, pages do bring new beginnings. So you definitely have a new beginning. There even could be a child involved. Exciting new beginning here. You, exciting messages. Offer. Invite. Um, there is something exciting that is happening. Good news. Now this, if you are single, there could be somebody bursting into your world. There's something to holler about. Some, you want to just tell everybody. Some, this is good news. Something is happening. This is urgent. Maybe you've got to go someplace in a hurry. The timing was off, but the time is now. Something like that. Mm. Offer, invite, good news. This is something you want to tell everybody about. But you need to take action right now, right now. Don't wait, don't wait, don't wait. Going through some sort of doorway brings prosperity and abundance. Hmm. What do we have for Leo? Could I have another fire sign here? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I also have Libra and Virgo. This is, and this is like running. It's just so exciting because a page of wands is an exciting new adventure. It's good news. Uh, moving. Somebody could be moving, going to a better place. Look deeper. This is traveling, going somewhere. Look deeper. Something is hidden. If you're planning on traveling, make sure you're looking at everything. This is uh, headed to a better place. Somebody is going to a better place. We do have... You know, it looks pretty stormy here, honestly. There's some sort of unknown, not knowing, but you, there's some, because of the moon, you know, the, look deeper, something is hidden. There's something you're not seeing clearly. There's a shadow. It's time to go. Somebody's maybe traveling somewhere, going somewhere. Ooh, act now, think later. The devil reverse is toxic energy. Or the devil is toxic energy. This is breaking free from a codependent bond, a codependency, an addiction, or this is a disaster. If you don't break three, free, it will be a disaster. Um, taking back control. We have somebody here that is moving. They're going somewhere. There's some sort of, there could be lust. There could be greed. There could be temptation. But this is taking back control. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, some of you. Look deeper. Something is hidden. There's a shadow. The devil is covered by a shadow as well. What you see is not what you get. There, and there's a shadow here. You see the shadow over the moon? I always tell you guys. I always say there's a the, the moon is covered by a shadow. I say that as well. So there's, there's something that you're not seeing. There is something that you are not seeing. It has to do with an addiction, a codependency, ego perhaps, temptation, lust, greed, money. Act now, think later. You gotta take control. You gotta take back control of a situation. Eight of Cups reversed. Underneath the bad timing. Something somebody's going back to something, or they're thinking about it, or thinking about leaving. This is either like taking a long time to think about leaving, pretending to be happy, pretending that everything is okay. This is extremely toxic. This could be a disaster. It's time to go. And this is movement. It's time to go. It's time to go. Somebody may want to come back around. I don't know if this person was toxic in the past. We do have a transition here. There is a transition. There's, there's, there's moving. Look deeper. Something is hidden. There's something that is... 
unhealthy, but taking back control. There's an addiction here. But the Eight of Cups reverse can be an apology. It can be going back to something. The timing was off. <clears throat> Maybe we had somebody who moved on from something because they had addictions or they were obsessed. I mean, the devil is an obsession. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles is having it all. It is. It's the ultimate abundance. And we do have a period of prosperity and abundance. I think you're going to a better place. You're going to a better place mentally. There's been conflict. There's been fighting. There's been hostilities. There's been uh, maybe a codependency here. Or Yeah, obviously there has. Or the devil wouldn't be here. It's action time. Thinking Somebody's been thinking about leaving for quite some time. The timing has been off. Maybe it's because of money. Um, but there, there is some sort of abundance here. This could be a new home, an inheritance, new money, a windfall. Um, there's something that is happening that is going to bring you this prosperity and abundance. Now, you know, I'm not sure if this has to do with, um, family, home, selling something. That Ten of Pentacles is having it all. It is. It's the ultimate abundance. It's flourishing success. It's prosperity. You're manifesting something. A cycle in your life is closing. Tens are closure. With a nine is a tens are the completion, but that and that nine is closing. You have a new beginning here. This is having it all. This is it. Okay, this is great. Going back to something, you may be leaving something that is emotionally unfulfilling. Somebody could be coming back to you or money could be coming back to you if it, this is money related. Look deeper. Something is hit, hidden. There's, there's a, we have a transition here. We have movement. Act now, think later. Breaking free from something. Breaking free from an addiction or a codependency or... A dark situation right here. Walking away. Have been thinking about it for quite some time. There's been some sort of wild goose chase. Somebody's been pretending. They've been pretending they're happy. They've been pretending that everything is okay. Maybe they were staying put for the money or staying put for the addiction because there was some sort of addictions involved or codependency or whatnot. The timing has been off, but I feel like we have a departure here that does bring the ultimate abundance. Mm. What do we have for Leo? Act now, think later. It's time to break free. It's time to break free. And this could be ego. Mm. Oh. oh, gosh, what a contradiction. Right next to that, Ace of Pentacles, Reverse is an unplanned loss. It's, it is, okay? It's an unplanned loss, it's a loss of something that was, you know, was had. Maybe it's you're letting it go or it's being taken away. This is uh, not stable. It's not secure. We do have an emergent situation here. There is news, an offer or an invite is coming. Somebody in your life may be letting something go. You, could be you, could be them. This is an unplanned loss right here, but this is a person, typically a younger person, somebody or somebody that is very um, young at heart, okay? This is somebody that acts impulsively, that likes to have fun, that is not fearful, that takes big risks, that you know, likes to uh, take adventures. You know, this is somebody that is very outdoorsy, um, doing something, taking a big risk, letting something go that isn't solid, isn't stable, isn't secure, going in a new direction. This direction is definitely exciting. There could be a sudden loss. I don't know if it is a sudden loss, this loss brings prosperity somehow. 
Now, there could be independence here. Somebody could be becoming independently owned and operated, even starting their own business. And I say that because we have the Ten of Pentacles. We take one away, we get the Nine of Pentacles, which is independently owned and operated, living a very good life. This is a, this this could be a new vision just this it's very exciting and we have freedom here this is freedom Some of you could be going back to something that brings you prosperity letting something go that you had maybe you bought it or you know, you had to have it and you just want to be free from it because you're ready to explore. You're ready to do new things. You may be letting something go that was once of value to you, but it's not anymore because you just want to be free. Hmm. Could also be somebody in your life that is taking action, doing something spontaneous. It's in a hurry, whatever this is. Six of Pentacles. That is about being well paid. It's about being rewarded. It's getting what you deserve. This is a gift. You may be receiving a gift of money or an increase or um, a raise or something like that. You're going to be receiving. This is a gift. If it's not a gift, it's being well paid. It's being recognized. The timing has been off. You are about to receive something. Let me tell you. You definitely are. This is going to bring you financial gain. Uh, uh, there is a let go that comes with it, however. But that's not a big deal. <laughs> it's really not. This is not a big deal considering what you're receiving. This is an increase or it's recognition or it's a reward or it's a bonus or it's, it's, being, it's being well paid. The timing has been off. You are about to receive something that brings you some sort of financial stability. Put it that way. It's, this is good. This is something you can put in your bank. I mean, maybe it has to do with a bank. I don't know. Going back to something where you receive, okay? And this is long term, okay? But this is a release, okay? I can't, I can't, we can't pretend that this is not here. Okay, this is letting something go that is no longer of value, receiving something so much better. I mean, it really is. This is exciting. Going on an exciting new adventure, letting something go that is no longer of value to you. Oh, because you're in your energy, right? You're strong, you're determined. Overcoming fears, glowing, glowing. You are gonna, you're gonna, this is high confidence. It is. You are about to receive some sort of recognition for overcoming something, for you're letting something go. And this is overcoming fears, mastering emotions, finding the inner strength to deal with something. Because that is an emergency. You're going to be dealing with something and you're going to handle it perfectly, whatever it is. Receiving, you're going to be receiving something that is going to, this is a boost. This is really going to boost you up. Finding the strength to let something go that is no longer of value. This is very exciting. Overcoming challenges. Mastering emotions. Receiving some sort of reward, gift, money, pay, whatever it is. Closing something. You're closing a chapter in your life. You are. It takes a lot of strength. Holding your head up high. This is holding your head up high. Earning somebody's trust. You may have earned somebody's trust. You're about to receive something. You are. You may be receiving an offer. I'm not sure. You're receiving a reward, a bonus, money. Whatever this is, this is something that you earned. 
You earned it. Anyhow, good luck.